Hello, this is the Ramblings of an Indisciplined Mind podcast for Tuesday, December 29th, I think, 2015. Hey, boy. Yeah, I'm kind of tired. That's because I've been working. Yesterday and so far today on my on my vacation, but it's getting some much needed stuff done around the house. Uh, winter decided to make itself known yesterday. We didn't have snow. We didn't have freezing rain. No, instead we had these little ice pellets that stung when they hit you because they were being blown by the wind a little bit. And that just kind of piled up and made it a big oozy mess. And then today it was supposed to, it's supposed to be in the 40s, even 4140. Right now my car says it's 39. So I wasn't too concerned about it, but apparently later this afternoon it's going to get cold again. So rather than let this crap freeze solid, I went out and scraped off the, the drive um, and the sidewalk and whatever. And I'm, uh, I'm hot and sweaty and, and pooped right now. So the, the house cleaning we've been doing is, is kind of a year-end purge. We decided, you know, we got a lot of crap around the house that we don't need that we've got we got junk in the basement we had clothes in the in the closets in the drawers it's just been there for years that we don't use and so we did we took three loads to Salvation Army yesterday and we loaded up a fourth um, and actually the the third load we did in the in the ice IT pellet, whatever you want to call that stuff. Granulated ice. But the fourth one, we just loaded it up and we took it this morning after a brief sojourn to that holy place of donuts, Krispy Kreme, for breakfast. So that was nummy. That was num malicious. But, uh, yeah, I'm taking load number five. There are bits of the basement floor that I've seen, that I can see now that I have not seen in ten years. At least. Uh, A couple bits where I probably haven't seen them since we moved in because I'm starting to whittle away at this pile we literally, we had a bunch of stuff in a... I don't want to be in this lane. That might bring it around the student driver. I had a bunch of stuff in a pile in a in a storage unit. Because we were in this double-wide trailer with a ton of room. And we literally, once we moved into this house, which had a basement, rather than continue to pay the storage unit, we went ahead and pulled all that down and... and uh, shoved it in the basement. And for the most part, that's where all that stuff has sat since we moved in. You know, most of it has just, has just sat there. It was in that pile where I pulled out that Star Trek, uh, that Enterprise D poster that I, I got mounted on the wall in the man cave but the rest of it can go I, I, I'm pretty proud of us because I think there were you know, we were, I, I don't know how many, how many individual things we looked at yesterday it was hundreds if not like in, in, in you know, over a thousand easily hundreds of, of individual items clothing Toys, 
books, knickknacks. I can think of, I think, three things that either were, hey, we were wondering where that got to and we, we've needed it and we want to keep it. Or B, we're like, oh, I didn't know we had that. Or C, um, it was just like, you know, I, I think I got a use for that now. So three things out of, out of all those hundreds, uh, I, I think that's doing pretty good. And, and they were kind of, they were small things too, so. It's actually probably been more than three because there's been a few things we've come across that um, my wife's grandmother did crocheting and, and, and things of that nature. And so we've come across a couple, a couple, three, four of her creations. And so we've, we've, anything that she made, we've kept for obvious reasons. But, uh, yeah, I mean, for the most part, uh, everything must go. And it is. Sorry, I'm, there's a guy that wants to get out here, and the, the backup for uh, donating is kind of preventing him. Uh, so, yeah, we've been, we've been going through some old stuff. I've, I've found a couple of things that I might share as a podcast, like I found this, I found this page where, uh, apparently we like to keep quotes of people that, uh, at this one place I worked at back in like 96, uh, of things that people said that might be funny or maybe could be, you know, be a bit of an innuendo if you choose to take it that way. And, uh, it looked like there was a funny thing, some funny things in there. So I will probably... I will probably maybe share a best of with you uh, at some point. That'll be from the studio, though. It's kind of hard to read from paper while driving. They they, they recommend against that. <laughs> For some reason, they're a little particular about that. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm in seven minutes. I think I'll let that be that. Uh, like I'm in line here at the Salvation Army, so... Uh, I did skip yesterday. We were just so busy, and then... By the time it got to be, you know, dinner time and afterwards, I didn't even want to go upstairs and record a, do a studio uh, episode, so I, I took an extra day off, so that's one reason why I wanted to go ahead and make sure I got one out today, uh, but my intention will be to be back out here in patio land tomorrow, and I'll be talking to you then, so be seeing you.